We are here today as uh, the National Steering Committee for National Celebrations and I'm accompanied here by my PS colleagues. Uh, we have PS uh, Rono in charge of water, there is PS uh, Arumayang for public works, there is uh, PS uh, Mary in charge of uh, public uh, health and uh, professional standards, there is PS uh, Harry Kintai for medical services, we have uh, PS Hinga in charge of uh, housing and urban development, and uh, we also have uh, the governor who has uh, been gracious enough to host us and welcome us to this uh, great uh, county of uh, Kericho. We also have other senior government officials representing the other PS colleagues. Uh, there is uh, the representative for the PS of uh, sports, uh, PS2. There's the Sports Kenya Director General, uh, Mr. Meto, and a host of other senior government officials. Uh, the bulk of the work that is being undertaken here has been uh, looked after or is being spearheaded by the technical committee that actually reports to this steering committee. Uh, and there's been a lot of work that has gone into making sure that we are here or we are into this uh, particular space in time. As you can see, we first of all have had an elaborate visit and uh, walk around of the stadia that is being uh, managed uh, by Sports Kenya. The supervision is uh, by, by our colleagues in uh, Public Works uh, with the support from uh, KDF. As it is, the main pavilion in terms of uh, the ingredients that needs to be used in putting it together, the concrete works is 100% uh, done. And what is happening now is the movement of uh, the members of uh, the concrete uh, works that uh, the installation has already begun. Now the stadia, stadia will have a seating capacity of 10,000. So there will be the main pavilion and then there are the complementary pavilion on uh, all sides of the stadia, which is being done through steel fabrication. We've also had to visit uh, the county commissioner's residence, which will host the garden party on, uh, on, on Mashuja Day. And uh, that is also progressing well, with a hard and uh, final date of its completion being the 25th of September. Now, the theme for the Mashuda Day celebrations of 20th of October is on universal health care. And in the run-up to the Mashuja Day, which is the 20th of October, there will be a week-long activity that uh, will be exhibited. And we are working very closely with the county government, led by the governor for Kericho, Dr. Mtai, to just uh, make sure that we properly profile uh, the event. Uh, as you are aware, the government is keen on making sure that uh, the issues to do with the health are properly addressed and the president will be formally here to kick off that uh, week-long celebration. Uh, the other arrangements with regards to security uh, in Top Gear, we expect uh, our friends from the Kenya Defense Forces to start their march out parade from the 15th of uh, September all the way to the big day. Now, there are a number of other ancillary facilities that are being uh, upgraded, starting with the roads, which needs to be fixed. Cumulatively, we are looking at in excess of 10 kilometers of roads that are largely going to be done by Kenya Urban Roads Authority. There are water facilities that are being rehabilitated so that we have uh, reliable water supply not just to the stadia and also the county commissioner's residence but also to the people of Kericho whether they are public facilities the hotels as well as uh, the markets and uh, the residences of uh, the people from uh, this uh, county